So we're going to do an unboxing of the uh, Blue Bowl. I got it online. Uh, I think I paid 120 bucks for the whole kit. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and open this up and see what's in the box. Uh, now I've never used a Blue Bowl. I just did some research on it online and really for what I need it for I think it'll work perfect. Tell you what, they didn't want you to get through this label, that's for sure. Okay, so inside we have the blue ball. This particular kit came with the uh, levelers, which is, from what I'm told, extremely important to have. So there is uh, three levelers in there for your bucket. Blue Bowl Leg Levelers Kit. Supposedly the most important thing you're supposed to get with this kit. Um, Blue Bowl is saran wrapped here. Got to be careful because you're not supposed to scratch the blue bowl in any way. So I don't really think it's too wise to package everything in the blue bowl. Make sure you pay close attention to the uh, valve here when you're opening it up. Do not want that to snap off or have any issues. Okay. Alright, so inside here looks like we've got the leg balancers here. Looks like some heavy duty alligator clips for the pump. An SPX Johnson pump. Uh, I believe it's a small bilge pump. There it is. 750 gallons per hour pump, an adapter, some hose, I'm not sure if that's the right length or if we've got to cut that down. And a blue bowl. That is relatively smooth, just some staining, that's no big deal. And that's about it. And the blue bowl itself weighs probably about a pound and a half, two pounds max. Um, real quickly, other things you're going to need for this setup is a five gallon bucket, some sort of uh, power supply to power your uh, pump. And what I did is go out and buy a 6 amp battery charger. This is a 6 amps at 12 volts. Um, people on the forums are saying that this pump is rated at 3 amps. Let's see if it says on here. Yeah, 3 amps. Uh, it takes a 5 amp fuse. Um, even the website for the Blue Bowl says you can use a 6 amp 12 volt. So that's what I went out and got because I'm going based on what the website said. This also has a 2 amp slow charge, which probably won't be enough to power this 3 amp pump. So we're going to push it and see what we got. Give that a shot. In addition, you're going to need something to set the 5 gallon bucket that the Blue Bowl is sitting on. And in this case, I'm going to use a Rubbermaid container that I had my sluice in. The beauty about the, my sluice design was I can just pop the sluice out, put this in there, do this, use the sluice, whatever I need. Um, and then obviously you need some concentrates. You'll need to make sure you knock this down to at least a 30 mesh. Um, I'm going to go as far as 50. Not too worried if I don't catch it with 50. I'm not too worried about you know anything finer than that. At that point, I think it's just a waste of time. 
um, for me. So uh, hopefully in the next video I'll have a video of me setting all this up, getting it level, and running the first batch. So till next time.